Hello everyone, and as usual, I'm here to bring you the latest in celebrity wealth and lifestyle. Today, we're talking about Tom Hanks, a name synonymous with Hollywood royalty. From his legendary acting career to his staggering net worth, stunning real estate portfolio, and impressive car collection, we'll give you an inside look at how the Oscar-winning star built his fortune and how he chooses to spend it. Stay tuned, you won't want to miss this exclusive breakdown of Tom Hanks's lavish lifestyle. Tom Hanks stands as one of the most celebrated figures in Hollywood, known for his extensive and highly successful acting career. Over the years, Hanks's films have been incredibly successful, grossing nearly $5 billion at the domestic box office and a whopping $9,960,000,000 worldwide. These impressive figures have cemented his position as the fourth highest grossing American actor of all time. With a remarkable net worth of $400 million, Hanks's financial success mirrors his enduring presence in the entertainment industry. Back in 2009, his fortune was estimated at $150 million, but since then he has experienced a significant financial leap. This jump can be largely attributed to the massive earnings he accumulated between 1988 and 2010, during which he reportedly earned $300 million from his film salaries alone. When adjusted for inflation, that amount today would be closer to $450 million, demonstrating just how impactful his career has been on his wealth. Over the next decade, he added at least another $100 million to his fortune, bringing his total career earnings from movie salaries to at least $400 million before accounting for inflation. That doesn't even include the additional earnings from residuals or what he earned as a producer and director, which certainly boosted his wealth even further. One of Hanks's first big paychecks came from the 1984 film Splash, for which he earned $70,000 the equivalent of about $172,000 in today's dollars. Just four years later, he earned $1,750,000 for his leading role in Big, the equivalent of about $4 million today. By 1988, his salary had continued to rise with $5 million for Punchline, a sum that would be worth about $11 million today when adjusted for inflation. From that point on, Hanks's earnings have remained consistently high, cementing his status as one of the highest paid actors in the industry. For saving Private Ryan, he took home a staggering $40 million, followed by $20 million each for You've Got Mail, Cast Away, and The Green Mile. Even in recent years, Hanks's earning power has shown no signs of slowing down. In 2022, he earned $8 million for playing Colonel Tom Parker in the film Elvis, a testament to his continued demand in Hollywood. Tom Hanks was born in Concord, California on July 9, 1956, to Janet Marilyn, a hospital worker, and Amos Bud Hanks, a traveling cook. His family background is a rich blend of cultures. His mother's family hailed from Portugal, originally bearing the surname Fraga, while his father was of English descent. Interestingly, Hanks is distantly related to both President Abraham Lincoln and the beloved children's television host Fred Rogers, whom he would later portray in a film. Hanks's parents divorced when he was just four years old in 1960. Following the split, the family's four children were separated. His older siblings, Sandra and Larry, along with Tom, went to live with their father, while the youngest, Jim, stayed with their mother in Red Bluff, California. Tom Hanks's early years were defined by constant change and uncertainty. By the time he reached the age of 10, he had already lived in 10 different homes due to frequent relocations, a situation that could have easily left a lasting impact on any child. However, amid this instability, Hanks found a steady source of passion in acting. His interest in performing arts began to take root during his time at Skyline High School in Oakland, California, where he participated in school plays despite his own feelings of social awkwardness and shyness. 
Hanks's talent shone through in various school performances, notably in his starring role in the musical South Pacific. Beyond the stage, his love for cinema also blossomed, as he spent hours at the Alameda Theater, where the magic of film captivated his imagination and left a profound influence on his future career in Hollywood. After graduating from high school, Hanks studied theater at Chabot College in Hayward, California, before transferring to California State University, Sacramento. Although he was passionate about acting, he eventually dropped out of college to pursue his dream more directly. His opportunity came when he met Vincent Dowling, head of the Great Lakes Theater Festival in Cleveland, Ohio. Dowling encouraged Hanks to intern at the festival, a position that allowed him to immerse himself in all aspects of theatrical production. During this time, Hanks won the Cleveland Critics Circle Award for Best Actor for his performance as Proteus in Shakespeare's The Two Gentlemen of Verona, a role that remains one of the few villainous roles he has played in his career. Despite dropping out of college, Hanks's early experiences laid the foundation for one of Hollywood's most successful acting careers. Time magazine even named him one of the top 10 college dropouts in 2010, a recognition of his remarkable achievements despite not completing a formal degree. Tom Hanks began his acting career in the late 1970s, showcasing his talents in numerous stage plays and minor television roles. His early career saw him make guest appearances on popular shows like Happy Days and Family Ties, where he began to make a name for himself. Hanks really caught the public's attention with his comedic chops in the comedy Bosom Buddies, which aired from 1980 to 1982. In the series, he played one of two young men who disguised themselves as women in order to live in an all-female apartment complex, a role that showcased his charm and humor. His big break came in the 1984 romantic comedy Splash, where he starred opposite Daryl Hannah as a man who falls in love with a mermaid. This film marked the beginning of Hanks's rise as a leading man, as he continued to solidify his place in Hollywood throughout the 1980s with hit comedies like Bachelor Party in 1984, The Money Pit in 1985, 1986, and Big in 1988. The latter film not only captivated audiences but also earned Hanks his first Academy Award nomination for Best Actor, laying the foundation for his transition to more dramatic roles. Following his success in Big, a turning point in his career, Tom Hanks has proven his impressive acting abilities in a series of notable films. In the early 1990s, he began taking on more serious roles, including the romantic comedy Sleepless in Seattle in 1993 with Meg Ryan, which highlighted his appeal as a romantic lead. Additionally, in Philadelphia in 1993, he played a lawyer fighting against discrimination against AIDS patients, delivering a powerful and emotional performance that eventually earned him his first Academy Award for Best Actor. Hanks reached new heights with his iconic role in Forrest Gump in 1994, a film that allowed him to showcase his ability to infuse depth and humanity into a seemingly simple but lovable character. The film was not only a huge commercial success, but also received critical acclaim, earning Hanks his second consecutive Academy Award for Best Actor, cementing his reputation as one of the finest actors of his generation. As the 1990s turned into the 2000s, Hanks continued to impress audiences with remarkable performances in a variety of genres. He starred in the historical drama Apollo 13 in 1995, which detailed the true story of a troubled space mission and the gripping war epic Saving Private Ryan in 1998, where his portrayal of a captain on a dangerous rescue mission earned him critical acclaim. In 2000, he once again captivated audiences in Cast Away, a survival drama that led to another Academy Award nomination for Best Actor. Hanks also tried his hand at voice acting, voicing Woody in the beloved Toy Story series, which remained a fan favorite from 1995 to 2019. Throughout the 2000s, Tom Hanks continued to solidify his status as a major Hollywood star. 
He captivated audiences in titles like Road to Perdition in 2002, which showcased his acting chops, and Captain Phillips in 2013, in which he played a real-life ship captain who is taken hostage by Somali pirates. Hanks continued to prove his versatility in films like Bridge of Spies in 2015, a Cold War thriller, and The Post in 2017, which highlighted the vital role of journalism in a democratic society. In 2019, Hanks brought beloved television icon Fred Rogers to life in Marielle Heller's biopic A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood, a performance that touched the hearts of many. His resilience has also been evident during the COVID-19 pandemic. On April 11, 2020, Hanks hosted Saturday Night Live, marking his first television appearance since his diagnosis. Hanks continues to pursue a variety of projects, starring in Greyhound, a compelling war film that he also wrote. In 2021, he took on the lead role in the sci-fi film Finch, directed by Miguel Sapochnik. Most recently, in 2023, Hanks appeared in Asteroid City, adding another notable work to his extensive filmography. In 2024, he made a guest appearance on the series Freaky Tales, further proving his enduring presence in the entertainment industry. Throughout his illustrious career, Hanks has received six Academy Award nominations, making history with two consecutive wins for Best Actor for his memorable performances in Philadelphia and Forrest Gump in 1993 and 1994. His talents are not limited to the screen, as evidenced by his Tony Award nomination for Best Actor in a Play for his role in Nora Ephron's Lucky Guy in 2013. Hanks has also made a significant impact on television, receiving 12 Primetime Emmy Award nominations, of which he won seven for his outstanding work as a producer. In 2020, he received the prestigious Cecil B. DeMille Award from the Golden Globes, honoring his remarkable impact on the entertainment world. Tom Hanks has made significant contributions to the film industry, not only as an actor, but also as a talented screenwriter. He penned the screenplay for the charming 1996 film That Thing You Do, which he also took the helm to direct. This film showcases his unique ability to blend humor and heart. In 2011, Hanks starred in Larry Crown, a romantic comedy where he shared the screen with Julia Roberts, demonstrating his versatility in various genres. Hanks further showcased his writing talent by co-authoring the screenplay for the gripping World War II drama Greyhound in 2020, in which he starred, bringing to life a story about naval battles with his signature depth and understanding. Beyond his writing, Hanks has been a powerhouse in film production, frequently utilizing his own production company, Playtone, which he co-founded with Gary Gertzman. Through Playtone, he has produced numerous acclaimed projects that delve into historical narratives, particularly focusing on the complexities of World War II. His work includes the critically lauded miniseries Band of Brothers in 2001 and The Pacific in 2010, both of which received praise for their authentic portrayals of the war's impact. The upcoming miniseries Masters of the Air in 2024 is another testament to Hanks's commitment to exploring these vital stories. Additionally, he produced popular films like My Big Fat Greek Wedding in 2002, Charlie Wilson's War in 2007, and Mamma Mia in 2008, highlighting his broad range in the entertainment industry. Through these diverse projects, Hanks continues to leave an indelible mark on cinema, showcasing both his creative talent and passion for storytelling. Tom Hanks and his wife, Rita Wilson, have built an impressive real estate portfolio worth $150 million or more. Mansion in Pacific Palisades The mansion, originally constructed in 1996, boasts an impressive 14,000 square feet of living space, featuring four spacious bedrooms and five bathrooms. Since moving in, Hanks has made several modifications to enhance the property, catering to his love for entertaining friends and fellow celebrities. The interior is designed for comfort and style, with a grand living room, 
a large dining area perfect for hosting dinners, a modern kitchen outfitted with top-of-the-line appliances, and a wine cellar to store fine selections. Additionally, a designated party room provides an inviting space for gatherings. Outside, the property is equally impressive, offering an expansive backyard complete with a sparkling swimming pool and a sun-drenched terrace. The front yard serves as a practical parking area for Hanks's esteemed guests, who enjoy stunning views of the surrounding cityscape and majestic mountains. Beyond this notable mansion, Hanks also owns other properties, including a beachfront mansion in Malibu Colony, which he purchased for a mere $2.95 million and is now valued at around $20 million. This impressive portfolio underscores Tom Hanks's successful career and his ability to invest wisely in real estate. Now let's take a closer look at this exquisite property. Mansion in Malibu Colony. Measuring an impressive 4,800 square feet over two floors, the home features a spacious main floor with three bedrooms, along with a separate guest house with an additional bedroom, perfect for hosting friends and family. The living room is designed for relaxing and entertaining, featuring a fireplace, built-in bookcases with comfortable window seating, and a separate dining area. For those who enjoy the view, the additional family room offers spectacular ocean views. The master bedroom is particularly impressive, with large windows overlooking the coast and access to a private balcony. The ensuite bathroom is a spa-like retreat, complete with a soaking tub and ocean view shower. The chef's kitchen is a culinary dream, complete with honed marble countertops and top-of-the-line appliances, including a Leconche range and Sub-Zero refrigerator. There is also a cozy breakfast nook that offers ample seating for casual dinners. The outdoor living is equally noteworthy, with amenities including a spa, outdoor fireplace, fire pit, and sunken hot tub, all just steps from the sandy beach. The grassy courtyard features a pizza oven and outdoor grilling area, creating an inviting space to entertain guests while taking in the panoramic ocean views. Tom Hanks and his wife, Rita Wilson, have proven their expertise in real estate investing. It's interesting to see celebrities like Hanks and Wilson leverage their success in the entertainment industry to make smart financial decisions. What do you think of this stunning mansion and the couple's ability to turn it into a valuable investment? We'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. But for now, let's take a look at the Tom Hanks family's enviable car collection. Car Collection Tom Hanks is well regarded not only for his impressive acting career, but also for his notable collection of vehicles, each of which tells a unique story and holds personal significance. In this section, we will take a closer look at four cars that Tom Hanks cherishes the most, illustrating his diverse interests and his passion for automobiles. First, Airstream model. One standout in Hanks's collection is his custom-built 1992 Airstream model 34 Limited Excella travel trailer valued between $150,000 and $250,000. The Airstream is a beloved classic, known for its distinctive aluminum exterior and timeless appeal. Hanks had this trailer built to his specific preferences, incorporating special features such as a bench seat with removable legs, which allows for easy maneuvering through doorways. This unique design enhances both comfort and functionality, reflecting Hanks' attention to detail and love for adventure on the road. Two. 2011. Ford F-450, Super Duty Crew Cab Lariat. Hanks also owns a robust 2011 Ford F-450 Super Duty Crew Cab Lariat pickup truck, which has an estimated value ranging from $70,000 to $100,000. This formidable vehicle is not just about power, it boasts a spacious cabin and is celebrated for its impressive towing and cargo capabilities. The Lariat trim adds a touch of luxury with its upscale features, making it an ideal vehicle for both work-related tasks and leisurely outings. Hanks's choice of this truck showcases his appreciation for vehicles that blend practicality with comfort. 3. 1980 Toyota FJ, 40 Land Cruiser 
Among his favorites is the meticulously restored 1980 Toyota FJ 40 Land Cruiser, valued between $75,000 and $125,000. This classic SUV holds a special place in Hanks's heart as it was commissioned and restored under his direction by TLC 4x4 of Van Nuys, renowned for its expert craftsmanship. The restoration includes a powerful 4.3-liter V6 engine and a 5-speed manual transmission paired with luxurious Porsche seats featuring power support. This vehicle exemplifies Hanks's dedication to quality and his appreciation for classic designs. 4. 2015 Tesla Model S P85D Last but certainly not least is Hanks's eco-friendly 2015 Tesla Model S P85D, valued between $70,000 and $100,000. Hanks and his wife, Rita Wilson, have driven this innovative vehicle over 13,000 miles. What sets this Tesla apart is its distinctive British racing green paint job, which reflects Hanks's personal style, as this color was not a factory option. An advocate for electric vehicles, Hanks has been promoting sustainable transportation for years, even appearing on The Late Show with David Letterman in 2004 to discuss the importance of electric cars long before they became widely popular. These four vehicles highlight Tom Hanks as not only a legendary figure in Hollywood, but also a passionate car enthusiast with a keen interest in sustainability. Each car in his collection represents a piece of his life, blending practicality, luxury, and environmental consciousness into one impressive array. Philanthropy. Tom Hanks has demonstrated his commitment to philanthropy and social causes throughout his career. One of his most notable contributions came after the devastating events of September 11, 2001, when he participated in America A Tribute to Heroes, a charity event to help the victims and their families. The event was extremely successful, raising over $200 million, highlighting Hanks's deep commitment to supporting those in need during such a tragic time in the nation's history. In a private act of generosity that was not made public, Hanks himself donated $5 million to the cause, further emphasizing his compassion and willingness to assist during one of America's darkest hours. In addition to his disaster relief efforts, Hanks has also played an active role in advancing the future of humanity through space exploration. He serves on the board of directors of the National Space Society, an organization committed to advancing the exploration, research, and commercialization of space. The Society plays a key role in advocating for sustainable practices in space development, which are essential to ensuring a prosperous future for humanity beyond Earth. In addition, Hanks is a passionate advocate for environmental initiatives, particularly in the search for alternative fuels. He has participated in numerous organizations dedicated to sustainable energy solutions, working to reduce our dependence on fossil fuels, and combating climate change. His efforts reflect his belief in the importance of protecting the planet for future generations, demonstrating that Hanks is not only a beloved Hollywood personality, but also a responsible global citizen, committed to making a positive and lasting impact on the world. Personal Life Tom Hanks first married American actress Samantha Lewis in 1978. The couple had two children together, a son named Colin, born in 1977, and a daughter named Elizabeth, born in 1982. Unfortunately, their marriage ended in divorce in 1987, and in a tragic turn of events, Samantha Lewis passed away in 2002 at the age of 49 from bone cancer. Throughout his life, Hanks was an active member of his church, demonstrating his commitment to faith and community. Hanks's journey took a significant turn when he met actress Rita Wilson while filming the television comedy Bosom Buddies in 1981. Their relationship deepened when they reunited in 1985 on the set of the movie Volunteers. Rita, who is of Greek and Bulgarian descent, is a devoted member of the Greek Orthodox Church, and in a show of love and commitment, 
Hanks converted to her faith before they married in 1988. They have two sons together. Chet, born in 1990, who made a name for himself in the music industry with a rap song released in 2011 and has also appeared on hit shows like Empire and Shameless. Their youngest son, Truman, was born in 1995 and had the unique opportunity to play a younger version of his father's character in the film A Man Called Otto. In 2008, Tom Hanks took a strong stance against Proposition 8, a proposed amendment to the California Constitution that sought to define marriage solely as a union between a man and a woman. In January 2009, while promoting a new television series, Hanks publicly criticized supporters of Proposition 8, labeling them as anti-American. He particularly singled out the LDS Church, one of the primary backers of the amendment, for their views on marriage and their financial support in pushing the bill forward. However, about a week after his statement, Hanks issued an apology for his remarks, acknowledging that there was, in fact, nothing more American than standing by one's beliefs and voting according to personal convictions. This apology reflected his understanding of the importance of respectful dialogue in the context of such deeply held views. In October 2013, during an appearance on The Late Show with David Letterman, Hanks opened up about his health, revealing that he had been diagnosed with type 2 diabetes. Medical experts suggested that his significant weight gain from his many film roles, such as in A League of Their Own and Cast Away, may have played a role in his diagnosis. In a follow-up interview in 2018, Hanks admitted that a combination of genetic predisposition and lifestyle choices contributed to his condition. He has since made significant changes to his daily routine, opting for a healthier diet and avoiding film roles that require extreme weight changes. Hanks's deep connection to Greece was recognized in December 2019 when Prokopis Pavlopoulos, president of Greece, granted him and his family honorary citizenship. The honor was in recognition of their extensive contributions to the country, particularly in raising global awareness and support for the victims of the devastating wildfires that hit the coastal village of Mati in July 2018, killing more than 100 people. Greek Interior Minister Takis Theodorakakos praised Hanks for his genuine concern and efforts to publicize the plight of those affected in the global media. Following this recognition, on July 26, 2020, Greek Prime Minister Kyriakos Mitsotakis and his wife awarded Greek passports to Hanks and Wilson, cementing their honorary citizenship and the family's strong ties to Greece. Thanks so much for watching our video about Tom Hanks. We'd love to hear what you think, so feel free to leave a comment below. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with others, and subscribe to our channel for more great content. Thanks again for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in the next video.